Hello, Virgo, um, and welcome to the fire group. This is only the fire group for Virgo. The other three videos get separated though, uh, due to a problem with the internet. Um, so you can see the three other videos in the other video. They're all on my channel. This is only the matches group. Before we start, also, I want to mention that starting 27 of September, Mercury is running retrograde, meaning it's not a good time for signing contracts, agreements, anything where you need to put your name under for officializing, it's not a good idea. Also, you will see during that time, um, like traffic is delayed, you come late, the, your bus is late. If you want to, if you receive a package, the package is late, it's not coming, it's wrong delivered. Also, it's not a good time for buying equipment for your housekeeping, like laundry machines or um, or microwaves or e electronic devices like cell phones. Why? Because these are connected to warranties and there might be a problem with the warranty. So all in all, it's not a good idea during this time to make arrangements or agreements that you need to sign. Um, if you, for some reason, are obligated to sign a contract, please double, triple check the containments because maybe afterwards you change your mind, you don't agree with the contract, uh, you want to get out of it and it's not possible anymore. So anyway, my advice to you would be not to sign the contract at all. So anyway, here we go with your card, card reading now for the matches group. The first card that we see here is uh, the coffin. The coffin is a card of transformation, meaning that you probably are in a transformative period. Some important period in your life is locked off and something new is about to begin. Why we think this? Well, because we have the child right next to it and the child presents something new, a new, uh, a new uh, start is coming. And presumably here, it has to do with your job. Probably you have been unemployed before, if not unemployed, uh, you are about to change jobs. You are uh, uh, engaging is something new. Probably you're a little bit innocent in the area. Maybe you don't know uh, that kind of job at all. So you could be a little bit innocent in the job. Now we go into more details here. This also points to that you probably get more maturity in your life. It's like you suddenly, you need to grow up. You come more uh, psychologically uh, adult here with this uh, combination. Um, if you have a problem, maybe with, uh, if you have a child, maybe the child in itself, it has health issues. This is problem here also, and you need to take care of the child. This is possible also with this combination that you, that you see here. Um, if you had a job before or a situation in your life changed, it's possible that uh, these changes brought you some grief, maybe related to the job, maybe you needed to leave your job or you had a hard time finding one and it caused you some grief. But here, some better times are coming here for you, especially since the last card is the sun. So we have uh, great expectations here and probably the, this will come true because also we have the tree here and the tree represents slow growth and health. So here you have progress in your life here in general. Then the child and the fox in itself. Um, in some cases, for some people here, this could represent that they are uh, planning or thinking about adopting a child. This is possible with this combination, uh, not a child that comes out of uh, uh, your, your, yourself, uh, but is it a child that you adopt by uh, some organization here that we see here. This uh, we, could, uh, we could see here with this combination. Then on the job, as we said, uh, you start in a new, a new job. Um, probably you need to learn a lot in this new job. Um, you are uh, here, here also you are, um, you are uh, urged to, um, to take care of yourself, to focus on the new job, to focus on yourself. Don't involve too much with, with other people in the beginning. Try to focus on your job so you have a growth. If you do so, there will be progress in the job. Then the second line we have here, uh, it's the woman and the whip. If there is a woman, maybe your boss is a woman or somebody in charge, there is a woman. Um, this woman could be, um, if this is you as a woman, this could be represent you as a very assertive person. Maybe you're a person that is quite active in sports. If not, you could also be like a military or a police officer. This is possible also with this combination. 
um, also, this is a person he, who speaks her mind. She don't hold back. She speaks her mind. She says what it's on her mind. If this is you that are in the new job, it's possible also that you put a lot of energy or you will, will put a lot of energy in this new job because you want to grow. You, have, you are a person with a lot of energy. If this is a physical job, this will be no problem for you. If you are more in high place, this could point to police officers for starters, but even people who need to judge others, like literally like judges, prosecutors. This is all uh, uh, pointed out here with these two cards. Um, then here we see the whip and the tree. Um, maybe before you felt a little bit under the weather, under the weather, maybe uh, that you could not find or that you had not had a job. It influenced a little bit. Um, this could be here that um, that maybe now everything is changed. But still, uh, if you have some health issues here, um, there you have the sun here, so you will have progress in that area. If you have health issues, I'm thinking if you evolve in the job the health issues will solve themselves. Um, it's possible also, if you don't have the job yet, there are negotiations about the job, that you are the one uh, that they ask you a lot of questions and you need to negotiate. Maybe you need to negotiate about the salary or about the job itself. This is possible also that we see here. Uh, if you have a relationship with a partner, uh, this points also to a, a sexual active relationship with a partner. So it means that you are both, both partners are very active with each other here. And there is some action going on here. That is what we see here also. Um, if you had some kind of conflict in the work, uh, or in, uh, in your uh, surroundings, you will see that this conflict slowly works out, it will slowly go away if you had some conflict. Then we have the garden, the mice and the sun. Uh, the garden and the mice, um, maybe before you go less outside. Uh, maybe you didn't want to go outside for some reason. Maybe you are scared of the viruses. Maybe there was another reason, but the mouse tend to uh, hold us back a little bit. It delays something. So maybe before you go less outside, but this will increase now uh, we, since we have the sun here. Um, mm -hmm. Here also, um, if you, I don't see directly a business here, but uh, this could, um, if you have investments somewhere, if you have invested money somewhere, uh, you could have some worries here about that. Uh, but since you have the sun here, uh, it's probably gonna work out well if you would uh, have uh, worries about that. Um, Possible also some people who you met before, uh, they will go out of your uh, circle of friends. Some people will, will get lost um, here in your circle of friends. Um, in another case, this could literally mean if you have a garden, for instance, that you have literally rodents in your garden. This is possible here also with this combination. Um, Here also sometimes is, it points to that we don't share everything with the people that we know. Uh, sometimes maybe things here uh, that you like to keep for yourself, you keep to yourself. Uh, maybe you're a little bit a shy type. That's a, that's a possibility also. Um, for, or maybe you're shy now for the moment. This is possible. There's some shyness here going on also. Um, then we have... Um, the mice and the sun. As I said earlier, you will need to make some efforts for the job. You will need to adjust. You will need to learn uh, for the job. Um, you will have to do some efforts because we have the whip here in the middle. So you will need to put some energy in the job if you uh, are looking for a job here. Um, if you had difficulties before, um, it's possible also if you still have a problem that you complain about it to certain people, maybe people who are in your group, you complain, not uh, necessarily against them, but you explain your problems here against them. This is uh, what we see here also. Um, then we have the vertical line here. We have the coffin, the woman, and uh, the garden. 
This means that is a person, as we saw earlier, this person is in transformation, this person is changing, something uh, old is ending, something new is beginning, the public life is restarting again here. Um, something also here, it's possible that something comes to you and uh, for a day of two, uh, you get some information from, from certain channels and suddenly you get a shock. And it's like you need to recover a little bit from the information that you receive here. Um, it's possible that this lasts for two, three days, the shock, but then you will recover. It's something that, uh, that hurts you, that touches you uh, emotionally. So this is possible with this combination here also. Then we have the woman in the garden in, in itself. It's possible uh, that you, if you are a woman, if you would be a woman, that you function in a very big society. There's a lot of women here around you. You function in a group maybe of uh, people who do uh, specific things that are connected to women. Uh, maybe you are in, uh, in some group, some activities that only are exclusive for women, a uh, social circle for women. Here, this is possible also. Uh, like or like a woman's union here this is possible also that you present the women in sometimes maybe in on the political front um, maybe you come up for the rights of women this is possible also so there's some political or social uh, uh, connection here with the people um, you meet a lot of people and other women in um, in in, uh, in in the groups um, it's possible also um that people um if you are a private person that for some reason you feel that your privacy is harmed or um like invaded uh it's possible that you experience that also that some people try to invade your privacy probably you are a private person and some people try to get information for, from you. This is also what we see with this combination. So watch out that nobody can, uh, can enter your laptop, your cell phone, so they don't check your messages um, because sometimes that happens that a person get to know our, um, our, our, our word or our, our, our password. Um, you need to be careful here for that. Maybe try, somebody try to check you out um, here with this combination uh, of cards. Maybe somebody is jealous of you. This is possible why this person would check you out here. Um, and you could experience this as a trespassing. This is possible also with this combination. So be careful. Uh, also, if you put things on social media, be careful uh, that these things are not used against you. Uh, don't put like collective things, just only things that are for everybody to see, but be careful what you put on social media here with this combination also. Then we have the child, the whip and, uh, and the, the, the mice. Um, the child and the whip here, uh, this, um, if you have a child of yourself, if you have a child, it's possible that your child is going through a difficult period or it's a little bit naughty to you uh, or it has a lot of energy. It's a very active child that you have here. Uh, maybe um, if the child is too naughty, you, you tell the child it needs to behave. This is possible with this, combi uh, with this combination. Or it's possible that your child is very active in sports, that uh, you have a very active a child that is related to some competition, some sports here. This is some uh, possibilities that we hear also. Also here we see related to the job, we need to have some discipline. This is what comes back here also. We need to, if we would have a new job or we enter a new period of our life, we need to have some self-discipline here. Uh, this is what we see here also. Um, if, your, um, if your child would be have been in a difficult situation, maybe it's been uh, abused by others, it's possible also that you look for justice for this. This is possible also with this combination um, that we see here. Maybe there was some conflict with the child and you want to work that out, exactly what happened there. Um, here then we see um, if, 
we had arguments before about something with a certain person because we have the mice here. It means these arguments, we saw that already, this is coming back now uh, in the other line. It means that these arguments will get less. So everything will be worked out because as I said earlier, we have the sun here and the sun works things out. Um, maybe somebody caused you some harm, this is possible also, but the sun in general points to forgiveness. So the parties uh, forgive each other, this is possible here also. Of course, that depends on the kind of harm that, but it may, mostly with the sun, uh, there is a balance found. Um, then we have uh, the fox, the tree and the sun. Uh, the fox and the tree, as we said, this is slowly growing in, in the work. If you are involved in a relationship with, a, with, a, with another person, because we saw here some jealousy already, with the fox, you need to watch around you. Because in general, this means that your partner is half-hearted in the relationship. So you need to be sure it's possible that this person uh, acts stable and as, he's, as you want to stay, but make sure, double check, maybe he's very jealous here of you and, and actually he's only the one himself who he or she is only the, the one half-hearted in the relationship because this is a general lane. So this could be he or she. So you need to, to be careful here with half-heartedness that this person is, um, is really honest with you. You need to be a little bit uh, a police officer, check things out, look around you, look for signs, especially if, if these people start to check your phones, then uh, there is maybe a reason for concerns here. Um, then uh, what we see here more um, also there's could be a strong focus on your body that you eat healthy this is possible also that we see here we know virgo sometimes take care of their body you, you take no risks for uh, what you eat and what you drink there's like a uh, a lot of uh, taking care of the body here. Uh, you think about your body and that is always good that we do so because our body is our vehicle. Also here, there is a, there is a, if there is a difficult situation in your life for now, this situation will make you grow. It will make you see things in a different perspective because you will learn about the things that are happening to you now. Maybe it's a hard and difficult time that you have for now or that you are enduring, but in the end, you will learn a lot about this and you will come out strong because we have the sun here. Um, then what we have here, um, it's possible also that you already suspected that is going on with a certain partner here. You, and you are you already had your suspicions or you already have your suspicion here uh, with this um, with this combination. Um, then we have um, the tree and the sun. Um, here this points to a person. I think if this whole situation is over, you will get even more energy because these cars are very energetic. So it's possible in the future you are uh, you have a lot of energy you, to spend. You can. Maybe for now it's a little bit less, but after this is all over, you're going to uh, have a lot of energy. Maybe if there's difficulties and you feel a little bit less energetic, but later on this will turn around. You come more in balance like yin and yang. You balance yourself more, so you will come uh, balance yourself here there's more energy there's good health coming here um this is uh this is uh, all uh, coming very good um again i see here um the, the, the sex life is, is not a problem but with the fox we always need to be careful if everything uh is uh, happening honest but that is not a problem. The physical aspect of the relationship is not really a problem here. Um, it's possible, we, we mentioned that earlier, this comes again here, maybe because of stress you had before, sometimes you have fevers. This is possible here also with this combination. We see this coming here again, but this is only temporary, this will pass. Then we have the coffin, the, the whip and the sun. Um, here it's possible if you are angry for a certain reason that you keep your anger inside. 
uh, you don't express your anger, you just keep it inside, you keep it to yourself. Maybe it's difficult. You're a person who has difficult to get uh, angry or you have difficulties to express your anger. This is what we see here with this combination. It's like you uh, refuse to get angry. You just want to control uh, the situation. You, um, you don't want to go into the conflict here. If there is a problem, you just want to... Uh, uh, you just want to just let it be like this here with this uh, combination. You suppress this, as we say, uh, we suppress here our anger. Um, this is what we see here also with this combination. Um, later on, we have the sun here. It's possible that once this is all resolved, this is ending in a, in a very good situation. Maybe uh, this situation, the relationship that you have now, is transforming in something better, or you start out later on in a new relationship. Uh, but both have the sun here, so you uh, are awaiting here some positive things happening to you. It's possible also that uh, in some ways you are not really uh, aggressive, but you are sarcastic. If people sell, tells you something or your partner tells you something, it's possible that you are a little bit sarcastic towards him. That is possible here with this combination that you give a somewhat sarcastic remark here. This is um, uh, possible also. There might be some slight arguments, but I think not too much. It depends on your personality, but since we have the coffin here, I don't think it's too much. And we have the tree here also, which makes us calm because the, the tree makes calm. Uh, so it's possible here also, maybe it's also, it's a wise thing to do, to keep calm, um, as long as the situation, of course, not escalates, and as long as there are no um, physical hurt to you as a person, of course, this is uh, something totally different. Um, then we have the fox, the whip, and, uh, and the garden here. Um, here we see again that there is a lot of jealousy in the, between the couple. This, is per, this points to jealousy. So if the fox is there, it points always to je jealousy. Also, again, as I said to do you, watch out what you put on the internet, watch out what you post, watch out what you say, watch out what you do, especially with the fox, we need to be, look around. The, the fox operates between dusk and dawn. So mostly he is not very open and the tree is slow. So it's best to keep it slow. It's best to just check it out where you are and where is the other party that is involved here with you. So this is possible also with this uh, combination. But anyway, coming back, it's possible that a person here of you is uh, very jealous. Um, if your child is very active, I forgot to mention that earlier, it's possible also that you are the coach of your child. This is possible also with this combination uh, that we see here also. Um, and with this combination also, if there is a lot of you in your life going on, it's like you have a feeling that things are your fault, but we need to reflect on that wisely. Sometimes this is not always the case. More, mostly there is more than one party uh, involved in here. So don't take the blame on yourself if you would have feelings that, that because there is more involved here and it's not maybe the right time to feel guilty here uh, with these combinations. Maybe you need to, to work out things and maybe the guilt is not a good thing to have here. Um, if it's related to our work uh, and we are there already in the work, it's possible that some things of the work there you don't like too much, but it's possible that there is a group meeting regular and uh, everybody's opinion is asked. And there you can tell your opinion if some things in the work you don't really like, that you can express your opinion and that the problem is solved like that. Um, I, that's what I see here also, that there is group discussions, group meetings for solving work problems. That is what we see here also. Um, that is uh, probably a good solution if there is a, um, a problem on the work field. Um, Anyway, if there are um, discussions went on on the work or in the private, as I said earlier, we have the sun here. It's possible after all these things are happening, 
that the parties apologize towards each other because we have the sun here. So it's possible it's uh, all a little bit fear, sometimes fierce, sometimes strong, strong discussions, but in the end, everybody apologize. It's only a storm in a glass of water here that we see here uh, that the, what we have here. If I think here, everybody, if, if everything is out justice, if everybody's honest in the work situation, there is a form of justice here uh, possible. So, um, Virgo, for the matches group, this is all. Um, I hope you enjoyed this card reading. This is only one. The, I mentioned again, the other three videos are on my channel in a separate video because there was an internet problem. Um, so anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching and see you maybe next time and see you in my other videos. Thank you for watching. Bye-bye for now. Thank you.